What is up, YouTube? Speed Ranger Team, and welcome back to Finding Paradise. Now, I have some time. I had, uh, I have some time to make a video. You know, it usually takes me a long ass time to make one or like to upload one. But you know, uh, I don't have any homework. I'm good. So we're gonna get right into it. So, all right, what, what did we do last episode? Oh yeah. Uh, they had like an argument. We found out that uh, Sophia doesn't really like the whole Sigmund Corp thing. She, she like apparently um, Colin. Yeah, Colin was his name. He's not happy with his life. I mean, just look at him. Wait, you can't go through. Never mind. You can't see him, but you know he was up there mourning or something. Uh, and yeah, he's just miserable. Or he, I don't know, he just doesn't seem satisfied with his life. We all have regrets. Be it writing, writing, be it writing, or a wrong. What? We all have regrets. Be it writing a wrong, or oh, be it writing a wrong, or dreaming long past. Or perhaps that one special someone. Huh. If you got to do it all over again. Who would, it, would you be? Where would you go? At Sigmund Corp, we give you that second chance to make things right. Because with our help, it's never too late. Huh. Well, I'm glad they made better slogans since then. <laughs> I guess, uh, wow. Oh, I have like a theory, man. You know like that person that was like, uh, behind us in the tree or in the I can't get up here in the trees and stuff like I don't know what if it's like a love interest I don't know maybe it's someone he forgot about but it, to me it seemed like he was stalking the couple so I don't know I I don't understand why would you even consider why would you toss aside everything we have for something make-believe? I'm not tossing anything aside. Yeah. I mean, don't you have regrets too? Yes, but I actually have respect for what I've been through here. What we've been through here. Oh, what we've been through here. My bad. Tell me, what do you want to change? I want, I mean... There's so many little things that just could have been better, you know? Uh, better? Better? What do you mean? What does he mean by better? I mean, his life seems pretty nice. He got a nice house. And if you call Sibby, what would you ask for? I... I don't know what to tell you, Fia. The least you could have done is to make up something nice, isn't it? Wow, she is mad. Hmm. What does he have as a regret, man? I feel like it's not. There's more to it. But I don't know. It probably, like, probably that uh, advertisement we saw is like some foreshadowing. It might be a, a love interest or something. I don't know. Remember, Colin is our client. Everything else is fluff. I know. Alright, so. Can we go in here? Uh, oh, yeah, we have to go back up to the balcony. <sighs> so, how you guys been, man? You guys doing good? You know, at school and all that? Um, what else? A nice little view here. Here you go, Colin. Come Wait a minute. Wasn't there like a button that could switch me characters? Which one was it? I I forgot. I know there was a button that could switch you characters. Uh. I 
forget. Alright, let's go. I wanna be Dr. What's so bad, man. Huh, what is this? What is this? Um. Oh, there we go. That was that green book. I wonder what's in it. Alright, let's go. Yeah, let's activate it. Oh, look, it's little Colin. What a little Colin. What are you doing? We're in his like little, little stage. Or is that his son? I think that's his son. Wait, how in the world? Is it right across? Oh, what the? Oh, that is Colin. Damn, what? Childhood. Yeah, childhood, man. Did we just skip his whole life? Yeah, what the? What's the big idea? I don't know how this could have happened. But since we're already here, try transferring a signal from the last memory. Roger. Will it work? Do you move it or? Oh, it does it himself. Nope. Not working. We might, we might have leaped all the way, but the middle of the pass is still unclear. Then what now? Are we stuck here? Uh, beats me. I don't know, man. What, what do we do? We're already here, though. Might as well look around. Come on, man. We're smart. Remember, we're the best, best team. Best team on the job. Hmm. Anomaly. Can we go through this window? How do we get down? It's locked. Oh, I guess we're jumping. Ooh, parkour. Hey, little kid. That book was the catapult. That book was what catapulted us all the way here, right? How very magical and equally annoying. Hey. Hmm? This book, it's not wet from the rain. Uh, I guess it glitches more than ways in one. So the book is not wet. What does that have to do with anything? Can we read what's inside the book? I really don't know. If I have to proceed, uh... Nothing. What about this bag? The clock. Ah... <sighs> Those parents. You hang in there, son. You're just gonna leave them? What the? Food's in the fridge as always. Keep this place in check, alright? I will. Yeah. Looks like they're going on vacation. Like, the mom looks like she's wearing a, a little, like, Hawaii suit thing. I'm sorry we have to leave again, Colin. But at least we got to see it today before we go. I understand. You need to work hard to keep us afloat. That's right. It's a difficult time, but we'll get through it. And one day, things are going to get all better. We'll make sure of that. What's going on? I'm guessing they're going to work, actually. You should keep eating more, you little scamp. Those birds were going quick for a while. I thought you hit a growth spurt. Alright, peace out, Dad. Take care, son. Bye, Dad. Huh. Well, looks like he's been living alone his whole life. And maybe they have money problems financially or stuff, you know, financial problems. I'm guessing they went to work. I mean, if they went on a vacation and go, what else is? That'd be messed up, man. Just leaving the kid all by himself. Huh? So what are you doing? Oh, oh. watching TV. And 
now, back to Rudog and the Red Nose Court. Hey, look, you're on TV. Say something. That's not how I remember the show goes. Wait, <clears throat> sorry about that. That's not how I remember the show goes at all. Huh, so his memory seems to be warped. So. Um. Click on him again. Uh, come on, do something. Oh, what the? What are you doing, man? Oh, he's jumping on the bed. Are you really? Are you for real, man? What are you doing, little man? Come on, Rudolph. You can jump too. No words, man. Not even gonna say anything. Come on. Gotta at least have something to comment about it. Um, need one more memory. Bathtub? Nope. Out the door? Nope. Guess we're going back to the room. Well, you okay, kid? Okay, little Colin? Is he dead? <laughs> I don't know, man. I mean, we're in his mind now. He's not dead. If he's dead, how can we be here decades later? Of course. Maybe it's his twin. Ah, to the moon? Dude, too soon. Yep, too soon, man. Well, actually, I guess it's been a while. A long while. Yeah, it has for a whole, whole lot of years, man. That's all I know. But still, not cool. Eh. So, what now? We just go back? So, wow. So, it looks like he spent most of his life by himself. Little, little man. A plushy dog with a red nose. Can we see what he's reading? Like, I'm interested to, to see what's inside that book. Like, or does he just use the paper to make airplanes? Huh? What the? Isn't this already the furthest memory guy? Yeah, huh. So. Come on, do it. You can do it. Wait. I just realized something. Hmm? A few memories ago at the Sigmund signing house. Uh, here we go again. And the boss said he put his best people on the case. This was like ages ago, Neo. But, but, I mean, but. He didn't actually mean us, did he? Because Colin was originally, aw, oh, you barely figured it out. To Roxanne and frickin' Rob! Yeah, yeah, let it go, man. That's utter bull... I'ma just say, bullshit! Okay, calm down. No! I am right! Ah! Oh, he turned Super Saiyan! Kame! Kame! Don't interrupt me! Ah, dude, <laughs> That wasn't even right! Wow, you really move up to getting sued by 2IP simultaneously. Sorry, Eva. I just can't have you go on thinking of gun tame. Ah. You could say you brought that upon yourself, actually. Yeah, you did. I mean, if you didn't say nothing, he probably wouldn't have done it. No, Neo. I really wouldn't say that. Alright, let's go. Oh my god, I love that movie, man. I love Dragon Ball. It's like my childhood right there. I be watching Dragon Ball Super all. Did y'all see that episode, man? I was hyped, man. Vegeta finally whooped someone's ass. I'm sick and tired of him always getting his ass whooped. Paper airplane. Hmm. Let's go. 
I wonder what happens when we go past the furthest memory. Alright, let's see where this goes. Huh? Oh, he's a pilot now. Why are we jumping through memories? And we're back to old age. Whoa. Atlanta Center, Cactus 135, Cruising 5, Level 360. Cactus 135, Atlanta Center, Roger. Altimeter setting 3017. Have a good flight. All timer 305, 3015. Thank you, Cactus 135. Yeah, Cactus 135. Well, we got a nice tailwind going for us. Sir, now that we're in cruise, I just wanted to say. It's an honor to be here as your first officer on your final flight. Uh, he's getting retired. This being me my first time as a first officer, but I won't let you down. Huh? It's all good. Rather poetic, really, passing the baton and all. But you should know. As my co-pilot, there are only two things I ever want to hear from you. Two things, sir? Yeah, two things. Yeah, they're yes, getting and landing gear down. <laughs> You're funny, sir. Hey, real funny, man. What did you say? Oh, you only can say two things. Yes, Captain. <laughs> of course, I'm just messing with you. Just remind me of back when I did my first fly as my first stop. That's first stop, so that's all. Man, my captain was then was a crazy mess. It was. Yes, Captain. You don't have to do it. Mm, you know, I was just kidding, right? Yes, Captain. Oh, my God. Now you're just trolling. Okay. Hey. I'm going to let my wife and son come and sit for a bit, if you don't mind. I'll sit in. It's my last flight, after all. They're not going to get this view again. Yes, Captain. You can stop with that now. <laughs> you have to keep doing that. Irene, could you bring my family? Can you bring my family in? Thank you. Oh, uh, so this is when he retired. Wow. Oh, memory. Uh, this plane. Fight where relations were still so chill back in the day, huh? Huh? Times change. They do, man. They do. Right, let's go. Do anything, Colin, you're gonna stand there. Um, oh. Alright, let's go back. So, what did you two say? Wait, <clears throat> so what did you two say? One last round? Is it alright with management? Already approved, special occasion and all. You heard him. You heard him, Ma. Go, go. Go on. Yeah. It's pretty cool, man. I, I can't get through the door. Wow, that's pretty cool. So, you gonna miss the views? Yeah, man. From the big bird, sure. But, it's not like I'm giving up the sky. Oh, don't you go renting those small planes. I don't trust you flying in them. Speaking of, I wish they gave you a bigger plane for the last flight of your career. Like one of those monster double deckers. Huh. I asked for this particular one myself. I had my first flight with the airline in this. It was a different time back then. A time with lots of peanuts. Peanuts? I miss them so much. You know, Dad. All these years of flying, you never told me why you chose to be a pilot in the first place. Oh, I haven't, huh? Psst, don't tell your mother, but it was to impress a girl. Who was it? It better be Sophia. I swear to God, if it was someone else, man. Yeah, did it work? Sure, I guess, I guess it was. 
Oh, oh, please. With the way your father acted, I doubt he did anyone at all when we met. Shots fired, Dad. Hey now, Fia, don't go spreading false rumors in front of our son. I'll have you know that I was quite stood back in the days. Oh, you were. Captain, oh, Peyton, that's his name. Captain, just a reminder that we're on the record for the black box. Oh, thanks for the reminder. Let the record show the biceps are out of this world. No, 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 they are really not. But they are. Then I pulled the. Then I pulled that yoke on and take. Wait, what? When I pulled that yoke on takeoff earlier, I practically lifted the entire plane off the ground. Isn't that right, Pin? Yes, Captain. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Well, let me tell y'all a story about this one time involving a jar of pickles. Don't tell me you couldn't open it. Okay, we need to maintain a, a stir tile, sterile cockpit for landing. Let's get you two back to your seats. Off you go now, shoo shoo. So you can open a jar of pickles, man. Are you serious? Sir, we're not landing for another couple of hours. I know. Hmm. You're suspicious. You're acting really. Watts, what are you doing, man? <laughs> but, you know, Colin, you're acting very suspicious. Hmm. Come on, Watts. <laughs> Watts, get up. All right, I'm leaving you. So, uh, are you coming with or what? Nah, I like this view. I thought you were acrophobic. Oh. Only when I'm not inside a plane. How about you go wrap up this memory and I'll join you shortly after. Are you serious? It's on it's on a loop. Yeah, but the picture from the seat's angle is just absolutely divine. In fact, I pity you or anyone who can't see the way the horizon meets the Don't give me that cabbage. Alright, so this one they got off the plane. Thank you for the lovely flight, sir. Cheers. Hope you have a nice day. Hello, little one. Hope you enjoyed the... Hey, the landing sucked. Huh? Huh? Yeah, so sorry it was a little rough. Not one of my better landings. The wind was... What an ass. Huh, maybe he wants to redo it, I guess. Man, I swear to God, if it was that little kid's fault. It was, wasn't it? Oh, you little. Don't tell me you want to redo this all because of him. All right, I'm back. You. No. Do we get off the plane? Wow, what jerks, man. Jerk. Little kid, man. That was so mean. All right, what now? Oh, a fellow cellist, huh? Here, let me get that for you. So I guess it was like a, b a bad send off for him and he wants to redo it? I don't know. Thank you, sir. Yay. Are you good at the cello? <laughs> Not really. My wife is really the, the real musician. Oh, I'm sorry about that. My wife is a real musician of the family. Beautiful instrument, though. I love playing it as a kid. Hello. And uh, we have to go back. Man, that kid was a little jerk, man. Come on, Neil. Neil. Alright. Uh, where do we go now? Uh, oh, is it the cello? Two, three, four. Oh, I'm 25 minutes into the video. Uh, come on, you. Let's go. Uh, guess not. Alright, let's go then. Yep. Huh. 
Dude, I was right about to. Whoa, what was that? Now we're back at his young stage. Why does his memories keep popping back and forth? Uh, how did we skip to the childhood memories again? And this time the memento isn't even that book. Is there something wrong with the machine, Neo? Huh. It's not the machine. At least, I don't think it is. Well, I mean, well, I guess that's... I, I, <laughs> Come on. Come on, Johan, you can do this. Well, well, I guess at least we know that we can go back now. Let's just hope this doesn't interfere with it finishing the job. Relax, we'll manage. Yeah, so what is this? Oh. I'm gonna save right now, and then I'm gonna end it. Okay, is there, is there literally anything else left, Miss Miller? Nope. So he gets the cello. So this is how he got the cello. This is your instrument. Get used to it. Wow, I hate teachers like that, man. Love playing cello as a kid's my arse. <laughs> liar, liar, pants on fire. Wow, you belong at grade school. Your child just jabs aside, Eva. And on an unrelated note, this place kind of makes me feel like I'm on the set of some indie French film. Uh, what? What about this possibly makes you feel that way? I don't know. I just, you know, just a feeling. Now it makes me feel like I'm in a French film with the whole music. <sighs> well, let me save real quick. Yeah, guys, I'm gonna end it here. Uh, it's getting a bit too long. I have to get back to my. Uh, uh, I'm gonna finish my art project real quick. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you in the next one, my brothers and sisters. Peace out.